Hey guys, alright, so first off I should probably address why the title of this video says SDK Sunday. So there's a collab channel here on YouTube that is having a little contest and they're targeting new YouTubers who could use a little push in the right direction and give them a little exposure that they wouldn't otherwise get. So I decided, hey, I mean, I like my content, so why not try and here I am. Okay, now let's talk about the other part of the title. Now recently I was on the internet and I saw this little diagram about the 2% mindset and I thought, wow, this sounds very similar to something I realized myself a long time ago, but now I was able to put it into words, I guess. It's probably some of the best, I don't know whether to say advice I've received or choice I've made in my entire life, and it completely changed the route of my life entirely. It's called the 2% Mindset, and I'm going to share it with you. Okay, so in our world, there's two different kinds of people. There are the 2%, and the 98%. The 98% of people live in a circle called their comfort zone. They don't leave it, they spend their whole life just getting by, surviving within this comfort zone. And then there's the two percenters. They're the people who have stepped outside their comfort zone and are basically embracing life as you're supposed to. And the one big difference between both these two groups of people are that the 98% are completely unfulfilled. They're unhappy. Sure, they're safe, but they're not living life as it's supposed to be lived. They are falling short of not only their expectations but the reason they were put here and that's fucked up. Now what these 98 percenters don't realize is there's a tiny doorway that allows them to just step right out into the 2%. It's not like they have to complete some kind of test or be born this way. They can just decide to leave their comfort zone and embrace the world. Now, sure I'm making it sound easy, which is totally not, but they can do it. That's basically one of the main reasons I'm making this video. They have the ability to step into the 2% and embrace life and feel all the excitement and fulfillment that comes with that. Two years ago, I was without question in the 98%. I was living my life just getting by. I was doing things I liked doing, but I was doing them with little purpose. I wasn't applying myself. I was just getting by, and this was boring. I knew that I needed something more, but I just hadn't found it yet or at least I didn't think so. Then I realized I spent a lot of time watching all these people on YouTube doing things that I couldn't even imagine doing. They were they were going places I have dreamt of going, they were doing things I dreamed of doing, and I thought, hey, I'm really bored, why don't I try this? And so I did. I took a leap of faith and dove out of my comfort zone and posted my first video on YouTube. Now, let me tell you, this video sucked. It was a really poorly executed vlog of a lake day, but I enjoyed filming it and I enjoyed editing it and I was happy with the feedback I got from it. And it was, it was definitely a step in the right direction. From then, I kept making videos. I kept doing random, I did Q and A's and that kind of junk. And I also started broadcasting on you now. All these things were things that were slowly but surely pushing me out of my comfort zone and turning me into someone that I didn't know that I could be. Fast forward to today. As you probably know, I just got back from VidCon. Now, I know you're probably expecting a VidCon vlog or something, but that there won't be one. And so I was too busy making friends and doing that kind of stuff, but that's not the point. What I'm getting at is I would have never imagined that two years ago I would be going to such an event, yet alone hanging out with people that I watched through a screen. And now I'm being given the chance to appear on a channel that I used to watch. By diving into the 2%, it's opened so many doors and, and allowed me to make so many new friends and meet so many cool people, do so many crazy ridiculous things and it's opening a lot more doors allowing me to do even more and honestly I think it's selfish to keep this idea of leaving my comfort zone and going out and doing crazy things and not telling you that you should probably do the same. If you watching this video take anything from it, I want you to take this. If you've already left your comfort zone and you're in the 2% then great keep on doing what you're doing. But if you're not, I want you to do something for me. Now, I don't usually ask people to comment on my videos, but I want you to comment below and leave just a dream or goal that you aspire to complete or achieve. And then I want you to get up and go do it. I don't think that's too much to ask. And honestly, I guarantee that if you do it, you won't regret it. All right, well, that's all I've got to say for this video. So if you would give it a big thumbs up, I would really appreciate it. And make sure to subscribe if you're not already and want to see more videos like this. And also, guys of SDK, if you're still watching and you just need another reason to choose me as your Sunday, here's a picture of me looking like Ryan. Don't, don't bring me down. That's all I've got to say. Don't, Bye. don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down.
Don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down. Don't, don't bring me down.